Um, pull up, if you can, for me, the muses. The muses. The, the, the muses come from a methodical world. Zeus and the muses. He's got nine daughters who in Greek and Roman mythology believes that all music and culture derived came from them. These are the nine goddesses that is responsible for therapy in a conscience, music, comedy, pornography, etc. So let's take a look at them. The first one is what? Calliope, mm -hmm. the muse of epic song, who gave the gift of song. Who gave epic song, the gift of song. This is the goddess of music and movie scores. You ever hear a movie in the movie? And bam, ba -da, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun, da -dun. This is the originator in under their mythical ideology. She's responsible for great productions. A movie can't be a great production without wonderful strings, wonderful sound effects. Number two. Celio, muse of history who gave the gift of history. He's given the gift of history. This is the arts, painting and literature. Can you understand that if you begin to study what the history books have, it will theory God out of your life. You won't have God because they have an answer for everything. Man, we got to preach this message. This is a good one. Uh-huh. Number three. Mm -hmm. Euterpe, the muse of lyric song who gave the gift of lyrics. Right. Being able to spit it out. Uh, poets and uh, lyricists, songwriters, etc. You know, America's really, really not exposed to great, great songwriters. In, in America, when you listen to a song, the music be tight, but most of it be, baby, 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 baby. Oh, baby, when I see you again, baby, why did you leave me, baby? I'm going to come back and get you, baby. <laughs> That's what all it is. That's all it is. It ain't, it, it, it ain't that deep, deep stuff unless you get a, you get a, a songwriter, a, lyric, a lyricist that had gone through a storm. You listen to some of the music that uh, that Eric Bo, uh, Bernay and after him and Holly, he got some songs. <laughs> and one of his songs says, "I don't want to fall through the cracks of a broken heart." My God, <laughs> ain't nobody in the church sung that. That was that somebody. He says, I don't know if you'll ever be able to forgive me for the things that I've done wrong to you, but I don't want you to make a decision right now. Because as far as I can see, I'm still supposed to be in your life. And if you make your decision right now, it will confuse the process. And I don't want to fall through the cracks of a broken heart. <laughs> Y'all ain't been paying attention. Woo! That's it. Somebody say music. It sets your whole atmosphere. It sets your whole mood. My. Mm-hmm. Where we at? Number four. Oh, we up on the screen. I'm in the book. Here we go. Number four. Number four. Th Thalia, the uh -huh. muse of comedy and poetry, the who gave the of gift of laughter. Comedy and, and poetry. poetry. Uh-huh. Who gave the gift of laughter and poetic writings. My God. Number five, Melpomene, the muse of tragedy, 
who is the bearer of bad news. Let's move on. You ain't talk about her. <laughs> Number six, Terpsichore, the muse of dance, who gave the gift of dancing. Gave the gift of dancing. If, if you, you, you saw Psalms 150 when it says, praise him in a tremble and with a dance. Man, if you think dancing with the stars is something and God created it, can you imagine the stuff they're doing up in heaven? Church got us all boring down here and stuff like that. I mean, it's going on up there. Party over here ain't nothing over there. Here we go. Uh Number seven, Erato, the muse of erotic poetry who gave the gift of pornography. Number eight, Polyhamenia, the muse of sacred song, who gave the gift of worship. Mm. See, I, I know that's a lie. I know who gave the gift of worship. You know who gave the gift of worship to me? Who gave the gift of worship to you? Who gave the gift of worship to you? Holy Spirit, who gave the gift of worship to you? God gave, who gave the gift of worship to you? God, who gave the gift of worship to you? God, who gave the gift of worship to you? Go, who gave the gift of worship? Who gave the gift of worship to you? Who gave the gift of worship to you? Holy Spirit, who gave the huh? The Lord, you know who gave the gift of worship to me? Trials and tribulations. His strength was made perfect in my weakness. It was the storm that formed that he came and got me out of. I didn't say the Lord didn't give it to you. I'm telling you how I got mine. And mine came through a storm. But when things was going right, I wasn't worshiping him. Number nine, Urania, the muse of astronomy, who gave the gift of astrology and the signs. Wow. Okay. 